I love proven ass hats like you wrong. Um, this is my hat. Basic America stuff. I had to dodge Cummins. I think it was like an 04 silver. I was all about the diesel car hardware and crap. I lived in a very um, conservative area for a few years. It was called Copperopolis in California. They used to do these uh, like town hall or city hall type Halloween events. I had a landscaping company and my grandparents-in-law, um, my wife's grandparents, uh, they were super big Trump supporters, but they were like QAnon kind of crazy. But, you know, I was watching Fox News before I like thought it was... Uh, or knew that it was that kind of scripted. Also, I still watch Ben Shapiro, Candace Owens. I watch both sides. I'm I'm not a leftist. I could give a fuck about race. I don't, I, I don't agree with Black Lives Matter. I agree in theory that everyone's lives matter. But I remember back when... Fuck, was it 2016, 27? No, 2019 or so? Whatever. Um, the Black Lives Matter was coming in buses to different cities and they were fucking looting. I remember being at a uh, Target in Modesto and they literally pulled up and started looting. So we went back to Copper and as we were driving past Sonora, everyone had signs out like, hey, we're armed, don't fuck with us. And I remember sitting um, in the back of, of my sister-in-law's boat with like the big Trump flags, the one with him, like Arnold Schwarzenegger, you know, um, all the MAGA shit, sitting in the back of the boat with shotguns. I didn't have one, but we were just chilling there, kind of protecting the property because Black Lives Matter, um, they're a radicalized group. So um, I, I don't. I don't care about George Floyd. I really don't. I don't care about this. the new people they keep trying to victimize. Like, they are criminals. Whatever. Um, I'm not a leftist. I'm not a conservative anymore. I mean, I grew up Republican. My grandma had her own pool business, was super fucking Republican. Um, when, like I said, when I joined the Carpenters Union, that's when I initially, like, signed up for it because I had to. So I was like, fuck it. But yeah, no. This is my hat. I even had a Trump mask, but it got lost when I moved. Um. But yeah, I was handing out Trump stickers. Like, we got them. I forgot where we got them. I think it was Amazon. Um, I still have it on some of my other stuff. But, you know, it's really cute that you that you think you know. I think Biden is an idiot. Like, resident houseplant. Um, you should know who said that, Ben Shapiro. But, yeah. It's really it's really cute when people would be like, oh, you're this way, you're that way. Like, no. Nah. I don't believe in, like, modern-day feminism at all. The wage gap does not exist. I'm not trying to be a pick me. It's just very fucking annoying when people that have no idea who you are or what you believe want to judge you on how you look. You know, it's giving, it's giving cousin fucker. The only reason I don't support Trump right now is because I don't support any politician. I think they're all full of shit. Um, I don't believe any of them do anything. I think Obama was a terrible president. Um, he dropped more, he dropped bombs on Syria, like the entire, entirety of his presidency. You know, at least I don't agree with all the executive orders Trump did, but he did what he said he was going to do. He did change stuff and whatever. Like people are like, oh, if you voted for Trump, you're part of the problem. Like if you still think voting matters in the first place, cause like there was a thing where you could check to see if your vote was counted and it was never. So at least in the last one, but yeah, um, that's cute, but I still have this. So. I think what, like, why the left seemed so crazy is because there didn't seem to be much going on. Like, now the current state of things where people are, like, saying, like, women shouldn't have the right to an abortion, that's stupid. I think if you seriously don't want to have a kid, don't have a fucking kid. Whether it's from our word or you just simply don't want it, no one's having abortions at nine months. Um, if a person even thought to have an abortion at nine months, can you imagine how they would be raising a kid? If that hypothetically happened, like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, racism is a problem. Homophobia and transphobia is a problem, but it's always been a problem. No one's going to change that. I'm, I've never been to a pride. I'm not saying I don't believe in it, but with all the mass pew-pews and stuff and people, like, wanting to, you know, act like they have a big dick because they have a big gun collection. In my experience, all the motherfuckers that have all the guns have a small-ass dick and are usually short. And I'm 5'5", five five and I'm, they're short to me. <laughs> but the point is, is like, Trump has gone back on the shit he said. He, has, he supported gay people, and he supported trans people. He, he was like buddy-buddy with Caitlyn Jenner, who turned out to be a, a work of fucking art. Um, but yeah, like, how did, how did I, how did, how the fuck would you know? Okay, first of all, just because I have tattoos and wear band shirts and express myself how I want to now doesn't mean 
that I am a screaming blue-haired leftist because I make fun of those motherfuckers too. Like, the whole SJW thing, like, with the Amazing Atheist and Shoe on Head, like, I'm fully kind of with that. Like, yeah, people should have the right to an abortion. If you want to own a gun, fucking own a gun. Do you need to own a semi-automatic machine gun? No, but I've never shot a gun. Never had one. Been around them a lot, but what's really say do I have on it? You know? Like, everyone should have rights and freedom, but we don't. We still fucking don't, no matter what. Uh, and the reason that pride is still a thing is because there's preachers, Christian Republican preachers, that are calling for us to be um, imprisoned, put in camps, or unalived. So that's why I don't support the P Republican Party, plus the QAnon motherfuckers are like, oh, whatever. And to be honest, that's why I hide this hat um, in a closet, because at, at one point in time, this was a symbol for change. Okay, now this is a symbol of, like, racism and being a fucking Nazi. Like, I don't, you know, and, like, I hate when people are like, oh, well, you know, if you say all is matter, you're racist. Or if you say you don't care if people have purple polka dots, that means you're, no, it means I really don't fucking care. I don't care what you are. If you're a good person, fuck yeah. If you act like a stereotype, then you're that stereotype. I don't know what the fuck else to say. People stereotype me and try to put me into a box every single day, just like you. So... Maybe, like, touch grass. Touch some grass. Maybe smoke some grass. It seem, you seem really uptight. You did not ever jump. Suck my cock.